Hi guys, my name is Dan, I'm a veterinarian, and today your doggy has a loose tooth and you want to know what to do next. Loose teeth in doggies are really, really common, guys. Sometimes it's genetic, the roots are bad, sometimes they get an infection or abscess, and basically you look at the mouth and it looks pretty dirty, but you notice that one tooth that's wiggling there and you're like, my goodness. I gotta get this fixed. So, what will you do to get that fixed? Number one, you need to go into your veterinarian and get an exam first. Your veterinarian's gonna want an exam because they wanna know what to expect the day of the dental cleaning. They're gonna look in your dog's mouth, they're gonna say, yep, I agree with you, that tooth needs to come out. And they will also say, we should clean these teeth, we should polish them, and that one and that one may be a problem too. They want to pre-game before they get into the dental procedure. So they know what to expect to better provide excellent medical care to your doggy. Now, what they're gonna do is they're gonna book you for uh, dental cleaning. Unfortunately, dental cleanings in doggies and kitties or any animal, they go under anesthesia. This allows us to scale and polish the teeth, um, the enamel, the crowns, and also under the gum line. If we don't put them under anesthesia, we can't do a very good job. Also, the veterinarians get to get dental x-rays. They will dental x-ray all the teeth. And veterinarians used to not do this, guys. When I first started practicing, guys, like over 10 years ago, we didn't do a lot of dental x-rays. Like, they were talked about, but most clinics couldn't afford it or pull it off. Now, everyone does it, and our clinic does it, too. We take dental x-rays, make sure the roots are healthy. So, we've scaled, we've polished, we've x-rayed, the doggy's under anesthesia, and we're looking through everything, and we go, yeah... That tooth they were worried about, that's a problem. Let's pull that tooth. And now let's look at all the other teeth. Based on the x-ray, our cleaning, the probing of the teeth, and now with very, with a lot of confidence, very much confidence, a lot of confidence, we can look at those teeth and say, that one needs to go, that one, and that one. And then we will call you and say, hey, looks like Spot has three teeth here I'm worried about. Is it okay? And guys, in the end, it's, it's your decision. But medically, as a, your medical professional, I want to provide the best advice possible. So I'm going to tell you my concerns and why we should pull them. Like, we want the, the mouth to not be painful. We want the, the heart valves and the kidneys to be healthier. And if we pull these teeth, your dog is going to be happier and healthier and live a longer life. After you get off the phone, your veterinarian is going to go back and pull those teeth. We use a handful of different elevators and uh, different instruments to pull teeth. And if there's, a lot, if there's a really big hole, like some of the bigger teeth, like the carnassials and the canines, we'll make a gingival flap and we suture that closed so we're not left with a big hole in the mouth. You should never have a big hole in the mouth, guys. They should clean it, suture it, and give your doggy back to you better than ever. Most dogs, guys, heal up in a couple days. If they're sutures, they heal over about a week or so. And if they feel like antibiotics are needed, they will fill some antibiotics and probably an anti-inflammatory to make sure your doggy is comfortable as they recover. As always, guys, if this content was helpful, please go ahead and subscribe and like. I would greatly appreciate it. If you have any experience with dental cleanings on your doggy or kitty, go ahead and tell us about it. As always, guys, I hope your kitties and doggies and any pets you have in your house are happy and healthy. And I really hope you guys are too. And I really appreciate you guys watching and taking the time out of your day to click on this video and watch it. You guys have a great day and take care. Bye.